to be doing an Ulta haul for you guys and I am super stoked to do this video because that means I get to start using all of these awesome new products that I purchased. I did an online shopping uh, order again and so I have a few products here to show you and I need your guys' feedback. I need to know if you guys would rather me do frequent smaller hauls or less frequent large collective hauls. So let's go ahead and just jump right into the haul. The first thing that I got uh, a lot of these things were actually recommendations by from watching other YouTube videos and this one is one of those recommendations. I got the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous 3-in-1 Foundation and I am super excited to try this. I got it in buff beige and I think that this is going to match me perfectly. I haven't tried it yet, but it does look like it's going to match me. And this is supposed to be the lasting power of primer, coverage of a concealer, and blendability of foundation in one and shine free. The next thing I got was also from CoverGirl, and it's the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Brilliant Shine Top Coat. And this is a nail varnish that is clear, and I basically just needed a good top coat. I really like the CoverGirl Outlast nail polish that they've come out with, and so I thought I would give this one a shot. Hopefully it does not bubble. I have been having the worst luck with top coats bubbling up on my nails, and I've, it's been driving me crazy. On the topic of nail polish, I did pick up two other nail polishes online, and they are absolutely stunning in person. I'm so excited for them. They are by the brand Essence. I have never tried Essence nail polishes, but I have heard reviews that they kind of dry in more of a gel-like way. I got this new Essence nail polish in Nude Glam. It has a sticker on it that says new. The only weird thing about these Essence nail polishes is they don't have names on them, but they do have numbers underneath them, and I'm assuming that maybe that's how you can find the color. And this number is 12. It's kind of a peach nude. And the next shade that I got is more of a bright coral, and I thought it'd be perfect for on my toenail pol toenails. And this is called Essence Color and Go, and this is in the number 23. The next two things that I got are both by NYX, and they are their new butter glosses. And the first color that I got is in Eclair. The next color that I got is in Creme Brulee. And I'll go ahead and swatch both of those for you. Eclair is on the top and Creme Brulee is on the bottom. And you can see how they have such a shiny, glossy finish. I can already tell when I swatch them that they're not sticky at all. They feel very silky and very pigmented, way more pigmented than I had even thought. I'm saving the best for last. The last thing that I picked up was a Urban Decay palette, and this is the Ammo palette. It's absolutely gorgeous. It is got this shiny purple as well as like a velveteen feel, and I got this on sale because they are repackaging this palette. It has 10 beautiful shades, and I will just do a close-up on this so you can see an overview of all the shades. find the link to it I will link it in the bottom bar because it's regularly $38 I believe and I got it for 16 so can't beat that and so that is everything that I got at Ulta and I really hope that you guys enjoyed watching this haul and if you guys want reviews on any of the products that I bought then let me know also if you want to see some tutorials using my new Urban Decay palette then I would love to do that as well and so I think that's everything that I wanted to show you and so I will talk to you all very soon in my next video Bye.